Let's make sure you're looking stylish this holiday season without breaking the bank. Danny Schlaw is here with us, a style coach. So we all recognize this. We all recognize the ugly sweater that we pull out just once a year. In fact, in my closet, I literally have a section that I only wear once. How yes. pathetic. Okay, yes. so you're trying awesome. to get us to use these outfits more than once. Right, exactly. Okay. So yes, Help you can out. believe in the ugly Christmas sweater, but <laughs> again, this is gonna accumulate dust, and I see it in every client's closet that I go into. Yeah. They have this special section. Oh, this is my holiday section. Mm -hmm. You only wear it once a year, and the next year it's got dust on it, and maybe it's dated at that point, you know? Right. Okay, so, so tell us what we need to do different. Okay, so instead of like saturated red mm -hmm. and green, how about just pick red? Or just oh. pick sparkles, so. So less prints. Sure, okay. yes, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. And it can be something with a little bit of shine, right? Mm -hmm. But Of course, so, yeah, the sparkles are always in trend. Oh my gosh, yeah. sparkles are everywhere. Yeah, but, especially like around this holiday season. Yeah, um, if you wanna do the red though, let's say it's great for New Year's, it's great for Valentine's Day, it's, you know, like go Utes. Yeah, extremely versatile. Yeah, and then if I want to just make it more Christmassy, then maybe I'll just add my little, hey, little silly, silly hat. Yeah, yeah, hat. <laughs> yeah. And if we're going for a New Year's, New Year's we're gonna do oh, this. Okay, and look, because you saw the tag on it, I can see you only bought it for $3 yeah. from H&M. So we're, so we're not breaking the bank on these things. No, of I'm course not. I'm pretty sure not. they have them at the dollar store too. Okay, so almost like spend a couple of extra dollars maybe on like accessories yes. and not necessarily the outfits. Yes, okay. so we're going versatile, more versatile with the actual clothes themselves. Another thing, shimmer and shine is a good thing, but also velvet this time of year. We can wear it yeah. to so many different yeah. occasions. Exactly, and it's a subtle way to have a little bit of shine and sparkle it's still gonna play off the lights it looks dressy but yeah it's more versatile you could wear this to a concert you could wear, wear this it to work. yeah or dressy dinner wear okay. it to work exactly I love the Ooh. okay sorry <laughs> keep going <laughs> Um, I love the waxed cotton. It looks oh, yeah. like leather, mm -hmm. but it breathes like cotton and it's stretchy. And again, it does have a little bit of shine, but it's not quite so in your face. Right. It's sparkle. still just as warm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Now that I careful, as I carefully back up, <laughs> show us more looks. Watch the feet. Um, satin is another way to add a little bit of shine. And yeah, let's add some bling with a cute cuff or a necklace and. Mm -hmm. Um, the wide leg pants. One thing I wanted to mention was when you wear the shine, where do you wear it for your figure? So if you have okay. a triangular figure type and you carry your weight in your hips, yeah. put the shine on the upper body. Oh. If you're the opposite and you've mm -hmm. got broader hips or carry your weight in your tummy, you can put it down here okay. on your hips or in the center front. So people are worried about like, do I wear the bling? Is it gonna make me look heavy? Okay. Depends on where you put it. I've heard black is best though. It's very slendery. It, it is, but really okay. any darker, duller color is going to be too. Okay, good. Well, we let's wanna, move on. We wanna, we wanna control the focus. Um, and then dresses, like this could be a nice winter dress for a winter wedding. It's got the red in it oh, and yeah. it's got the white, but it's not screaming Candy Christmas. Candy case, yeah. yeah. No, yeah. I definitely didn't look at that and think like, and oh. I And I might even wear it with my black leather boots and just you could even maybe pair that with some brown leather in the fall yeah it's like kind of a transition dress this and this length this midi length uh -huh. can be tricky for people because it could hit the widest part of your calf so uh -huh. wear it with a higher boot okay so you're not seeing a gap between the hem of the dress and the top of your boot okay let's move on to this and then look. one more little sparkly that mustard some people call it that ugly yellow green but it can be amazing, especially if you have red hair or if oh. you have hazel green eyes, it's gorgeous. And and this crepey fabric is another one of those with a subtle shine. Something to keep you warm. It has a little bit of a collar. Yeah. The long sleeve's very appropriate, but also lightweight. I mean, you yeah. can wear this indoors or outdoors with a jacket on or yeah. a nice yeah. sweater to. to and it's got pair the with. ruching, so if you you know like pack on a little bit of holiday, too many <laughs> chocolate covered cherries, whatever. Guilty as charged. <laughs> 
that's gonna hide it a little bit that's better. That's a good look. Okay, yeah. um, last but not least, where do we go for more style tips? Stylebydanny.com, and my blog has all of the shopping links for these things Oh, on it. awesome, so for these particular links. Yep. I know last time you were here, we talked a lot about the Target styles yeah. and things that'd be versatile throughout the year, yeah. but this is more like holiday classics that yes. we don't have to just wear to the ugly sweater party exactly. or just to New Year's. They're dust resistant. Dust resistant. Because you're gonna wear them more. Oh, I like that. <laughs> Danny, thank you so much. And cheers to the holiday season. You too. All right. Go shopping. <laughs>